Montpellier and Amiens were meeting in the top flight of French football for the very first time. A week ago, Michel Desacarin's Montpellier had suffered a 1-0 defeat against Rennes. But the 2012 league champions had another opportunity to win another home match of the season. It would be their third. The Ligue 1 Conférence newcomers needed a win to distance themselves from the drop zone. And Montpellier thought that they had scored early on through Suleiman Kamara, but he was ruled offside. It was good play on the right flank, a phenomenal header for the assistant referee. Not allowing the goal to stand. And after review, it was a good decision by him. Kamara a yard or so offside. But that didn't take anything away from his header. Brilliant finish. Amiens responded shortly afterwards. As they kept the ball in midfield, it was played up to Musa Konate, who hit it on the volley, and it bounced off the post. Le Comte beaten, but the score still poised at 0-0. The referee blew for half-time, both teams needing to do a lot more to try and get the three points in this match. Not that much excitement in the opening 45 minutes. Following the restart, Montpellier thought they had scored again, but this time it was a phenomenal save by Gurtner, which denied Kamara. Absolutely incredible by the Amiens goalkeeper, who kept his team level. Then in the 81st minute, Star striker for Montpellier, Giovanni Sio was played in after beautiful play and a delightful chip to put his side ahead with less than 10 minutes to play. But it wouldn't last much, much longer as Danilo Avila, the Brazilian with an acrobatic goal in the 88th minute to draw Amiens level. And the scores would not move from there. Montpellier go up to eighth place after that draw, whereas Amiens slipped down to 17th, just one point above the relegation zone.